Hi, I'm Laurent. I'm the Senior Product Line Manager for Managed Switches at Netgear. And I'm Derek Falberg, Senior Sales Engineer for Netgear Switching. Laurent, what exactly do we have in front of us here? That's a brand new 10 gigabit Ethernet switch. That's the M4396X, and that's very special because it's a modular switch. It comes empty and it can scale from zero all the way up to the 96 port 10 gig port count or 24 port of 40 gig Ethernet. Well, Laurent, my understanding is it used to be voice over IP and then cameras over IP, and now we're talking about audio video over IP. That's right, yes, because at the end, IP and Ethernet always win. You know, AV applications so far required uh, costly and complex metric switchers, a lot of additional components such as transport extenders or uh, multiplexers or video wall processors. And instead of that, now with video over IP, because this is converging to IP, we are going to streamline all that, simplifying those AV installations with uh, AV uh, encoders and AV decoders with a standard off-the-shelf Ethernet switch. And I think that simplification is a huge benefit to our pro-AV customers. Let's go to the point now. What is video over IP? Video over IP is, in all case, strong, robust, proven layer 2 multicast Ethernet. So the good news is that most AV technologies require one gig Ethernet. So the 4300 switches are fully featured for that. But there is a new technology. There is a software-defined video over Ethernet alliance called SDVOE. Are we talking about 10 gig Ethernet here? Is that where the pro AV industry is going? That's exactly the point. Because with one gig Ethernet, you don't have enough speed to move all those packets. For 4K, especially the 4K60 with HDR, you got to compress so much that you will lose quality and the latency goes up to the roof. Unlikely with 10 gig Ethernet, you have so much bandwidth that SDVOE technology can transport 4K HDR video with virtually no latency and unaltered quality. So Derek, as a sales engineer, in a typical AV installation with those uh, software-defined video over Ethernet encoders and decoders and display, how hard is it going to be to configure this backbone modular 10 gig switch? Well, Ron, there are three features that you have to configure. One is IGMP snooping, the other is IGMP query, and the third is fast sleeve. Now, the great news is, is that these features are enabled by default out of the box so there's absolutely nothing that our customers need to do when it comes to a configuration in order to get their video working over the switch. So is that meaning that out of the box, this switch can actually connect those AV encoders and decoders, the management platform, and will that flow automatically? Absolutely, right out of the box. That is a great news. Laurent, I'm interested. How do I go about designing my own version of this 96X M4300. That's great. You just need to go to that configurator page. You see the address below. This way you can easily design your solution, choose your 10 gig connectivity, your 40 gig connectivity, all your options, and you will be good to go. Awesome. Well, thank you all for joining us. And thank you for your time.